Coons, Travis, I haven't had a chance to talk to you since last year, but you, I don't think you ever really talked to anybody about the two left-footed punts that you had last year. <laughs> no, I talk to me about those. I mean, if, if I put you out there right now and you had to punt left-footed, how far could you go? Uh, honestly, it's, if I'm lucky, 35 yards maybe. <laughs> Is that something that you've done before or just kind of fooling no, around in practice? The, the, first one, uh, the first one just happened out of nowhere. I really didn't have anything to do, so last second just – thought about it and I just pulled it up and hit it with my left and it ended up, ended up working out really good. And then the second one, um, just from like remembering what I did that game, I was like, why not do it again? I did it again. And so, do you remember if Sark said anything to you on the sidelines after that? I don't remember. How about film? Uh, film, eh, no, no one really says anything, just a nice punt kind of thing. And hopefully we don't have to do that again. How hard was it last year doing kickoffs, punting and kicking? It's definitely a challenge. Uh, doing all three it really takes a lot out of your leg, especially for kickoffs. Doing kickoffs by itself is a lot. So doing kickoffs, field goals, punts, that's a big thing. It takes and, a lot of my legs. And then on kickoffs, did you get hit at all? Did anybody take uh, – do you remember last year, did you ever get really taken out on a um, kick? No, not really. I got hit a couple times off of the punt when SC blocked that one punt. I went down to try to pick it up to, so they can't score a touchdown. As soon as I went down, I got just – Okay, so if Sark came up to you and said, Travis, you only get to do one. You yeah. can kick off, you can punt, or you can kick field goals. You can only you only get to do one. What are you, what are you going to tell him? The field goals. I like the field goals. If I could focus on one thing, I think that would be cool. Because if I focus on that one thing, then I could get a lot better at that. So uh, for right now, uh, just doing punt and field goal is helping out a lot. Because I get to focus more on those two. And then with having Cameron here, he can work a little more on uh, kickoffs. And maybe he'll do that and I'll just do punt and field goal or... The be What's it like having a guy like Cameron come in? I mean, he's pretty, pretty highly thought of. He's a recruited guy. Tell me about you know being here, but then having a guy come in like that. Uh, Cameron's a great kicker, great kicker. Uh, he went to Sailor when I was helping out with Chris Sailor, and I saw him there, and I remember asking him, I was like, hey, man, where are you, where are you looking at going? He's like, oh, talking to Washington. Also. I was like, Washington's a great school, man. You should come out and check it out. And a couple weeks later, he's committed, so that's great. And having him out here for competition just only makes it a little better. Right. So... <laughs> And are you focusing just right now on field goals and, and, and then punting as well? Yeah. What do you feel more comfortable doing? I know you like the... Um, well, today was like really my first day actually getting back into the rhythm of punting. So I had a pretty good day with punting today. And then uh, my field goals, all, so far all spring, my field goals have been pretty solid because I get to focus on those more. So. Yeah. And, and plus, you know, with the, the field goal, there's always a chance they're going to pitch it back to you so you can run to, run to the corner <laughs> of the end zone. I hope so. That'd be really cool. You talk. You, I mean, do you talk to the coaches at all? Put that play uh, back every, in. Every, every time, yeah, every time. And, and what do we they... get a fake in and see what happens? But we haven't done it. Yet. All right. Uh, how excited are you for this year? And how much difference is it going to be kicking in that new stadium? You haven't been in there yet. Yeah, uh, I haven't been in there yet. Um, looking at it's going to be a great stadium. But uh, next year, since I get to focus on just these two things, I think it's going to be a great year. So. But see, the goalposts go up first, right? Mm-hmm. You know they're going to go up in a couple weeks. You know that, yeah. right? And just when Safeco was being built, you know, Griffey and Buner and Edgar went in there before it was finished, oh, really? and we're hitting balls out of it. Okay. So any chance we're going to see you, uh, you're going to get a call from a police report. You're going to be <laughs> breaking in the stadium, trying to kick a field goal before Maybe. the stadium opens. Maybe. We'll see. We'll see. <laughs> All right.